three miles north of Don City Antenna, north uh, westbound. Three thousand eight hundred five to five thousand. Okay. Hey. 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 Hey, 2016, the Migos from 2016 called. So ridiculous. What do we do before every maneuver? Pre maneuver checklist. Do it. What heading do you want to do slow fly on? One round, Let's do it. Alright, so fuck 240. So that's what we're going to try and maintain. In this maneuver, we're going to really focus on maintaining altitude, maintaining heading, and maintaining airspeed. Not focusing fully inside, using okay. a lot of outside references and stuff, and make sure we're checking the traffic and all that. So keeping our head on a swivel. Okay. So we're power back to 1700. We're using uh, flaps? Yeah, we use flaps. So 1700, introduce the flaps, get it down to around 60 knots, and then 2000 RPM and hold it. All right, 1700. Let's do it. Get yourself your flaps in there. Wasn't it at 60? Uh, 60 is when you're adding your power. Back oh, in. okay, okay. Your setup is is bringing yep more flaps. Yep. Second. And third. We're already going below 60 knots, going 2,000 RPM. It's all right. We can get it back. I totally lost myself there. You're right. 2,000 RPM. We're, 2,000. We're fine. Yeah, we can get it back. <coughs> 2,000 RPM. We're just trying to hold that uh, that altitude, and we'll once we've got the altitude. We'll adjust for the for the airspeed. Okay. All right. Well, we'll definitely got to do that again. I yeah, yeah. It's it's just all in the setup. All yeah. in the setup. Slow flight. Are we gonna land now? Are we here for fit? I want my license now. <laughs> <laughs> I can barely take off. <laughs> <laughs> all right. No. Let me let me go through that again. I don't think. Uh, all right. Cool. Let's recover it then. So, take out. Not yet. <laughs> what would you what, what would you think you want to do first? Full power. Full power. Exactly. So we're going full power. First notch flaps. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Second notch. Po with a positive rate, yeah, you got a positive rate, cool. Kay. Second notch, let it accelerate. And just maintain 2,500 feet. Just around there. Third notch flaps for me. We're yep. climbing a little. Yep. And nose level. Nose level. At 2,500. There you go, cool. That's a decent. That's a decent recovery, man. Okay. And now you're above 80 knots, so you can bring back to that cruise power setting. Go back to cruise. To 22. And just making sure that we're not climbing that nose is slightly high. There you go. All right. <clears throat> 1700. First notch of flaps comes in. So as soon as you're below the white arc, which you're already below it. So okay. when you bring the power back, you can bring one notch of flaps. The inner, this inner white arc here. Inner white arc, yeah. You, you'll see as well when you bring that power back. What happens to the nose? It's gonna. It's gonna go down. Go down. So you have to keep that nose up. Which what does that do for your airspeed? Drops yep. it exactly. All right, let's go. Seventeen hundred. Pitching up a little bit below the white arc. We got one notch of flaps. Perfect. And then just hold and stabilize. Two four zero twenty five. Second notch of flaps. Stabilize. 240, 25, third notch flaps. And by the time you've got that in, you're just about coming to 60, 60 knots, so you can get up to 2000 RPM. Full power. 2000 RPM. Oh. We want to hold it in slow flight, right? <laughs> hold, <laughs> hold it in slow flight. Yes! <laughs> I want to recover now! <laughs> okay. So cool. Get me back on 240. Get me a little to, bit of rudder. A little bit of rudder, exactly. Get me to 60 knots. Beautiful. Beautiful. A little high, but uh, anyway, I'm looking. Uh, I yeah. Looked out much. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Look out a little bit more. It's all right. Okay. So we do want a little slight pitched up attitude. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. You have to. You're on okay. the back side of the power curve. We're still climbing a little. Still bit. climbing. So so how do you adjust? Pull back a little bit. There you go. Oh, we were a little bit over. A uh, little bit over, right? Okay. We're at 60, heading's okay, uh, 
Just need a little bit of work on this. Yeah, I need to, need to get that down. It's okay. Work on that. Get me down to uh, get me down to 2,500 feet again. There you go. That gives you okay. a descent in. All right. While you're doing it, whenever you're ready, give me a left turn. We'll go eastbound. So mostly rudder control. Yep. Just a little bit of aileron. Yep. And it's nice and slow. Nothing too quick. Okay. Let's recover that maneuver then. Let's recover it. Same recovery procedure as you did. Full power. Once we have a positive rate, is when the flaps. Go so down. full power. Nose to the horizon, maintain is uh, 2,500. One notch flaps immediately, and then you hold for a slight positive rate of climb. Slightly positive, okay. Second notch, and then once you're accelerating, past like 70, 75, last notch flaps, and then back to cruise. We're recovering, full power, and first notch flaps immediately. Nice. Cool. Hold, yep. stabilize, looking beautiful. Just maintaining 2,500, yeah, okay. You got a slight positive rate. There okay. goes second notch. Beautiful. And at 75, we'll do our third notch, right there. That's the recovery, man. That's the f recovery. Look, not move from that, not move from that. Release the Kraken! Damn! <laughs> <laughs> but now we are climbing because yeah, we're at full power. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> so bring it back to cruise uh, there you go, before we get too excited. Yeah. <laughs> so, my controls. Your controls. 3,000 feet. I'm going to... You're climbing up to 3,000, okay? Yeah, 3,000, so we're way above these clouds. It's power off stall time. Now, the reason okay. that we did the slow flight in that configuration first is because the setup is exactly the same for a power off stall. Power off stall is um, the stall in which configuration? Take off or landing? In a landing. Landing, yeah, exactly, because why would you be power off in a take <laughs> Dude! So it's going to be nice and easy. This is the easier of the two stalls. We did the clearing turns, everything's done. Fuel pump line, I make sure. Emergency landing point shows we've got plenty of fields below us. Yes, sir. 3,000 feet, okay? So the setup is the same, 1,700 RPM. Bringing it back, there it is, hold altitude. We'll be below the white arc. One notch flaps. Go. Stabilize, let it stabilize. Okay. Come off on my head. Come on. Yeah, All right, stabilize, 3,000. Second notch flaps, stabilize. 3,000 on heading. Last notch flaps, 65, that's our approach speed, right? right. And our approach speed, we're gonna simulate a descent. So we're just gonna push the nose down slightly, so we're coming down to the runway. And once the descent has been established, we go power idle, and we just slowly bring the nose up, just slowly. And you're gonna need a little bit of right rudder in this, because the left turning tendency is you raise the nose. We're just pulling it back, there's the stall warning. There goes the nose. Just push it down. Nice and easy on the power. Full power. Full power. One notch flaps immediately. And then just hold the pitch attitude. You wait for a positive rate of climb. If you drop a, another set of flaps now, it's going to drop away and we might hit the runway. You know okay. what I mean? So okay. positive rate of climb, we're climbing away. Still climbing away. Climbing back up to 3,000 feet. So we are going to lose a little bit of altitude. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going to lose altitude. Power back to cruise. So the only difference. Look at you! Look at you, man! I'm okay at this stuff. <laughs> yeah, I see. <laughs> stay humble. <laughs> yeah, stay humble. <laughs> so you saw the only difference between the slow flight and even in the recovery was the actual just stalling. You're gonna flight. stall it. Yeah. That's it. That's the only difference. Everything else, the setup is the same. Don't yank it back. That's what a lot of people do. They get nervous and they start yanking it back. Just hold it, hold it, hold it. Bring it all the way back. Let it stall. If a wing wants to drop away from you. Use the rudders in the rudder, opposite direction. Exactly. If you wanted to, you could take your hands off this and just use rudder to, to do it, just to stop the temptation for you to yank it. Right. Okay. okay. Your controls, get yourself set up, stabilized. Your controls, 1700. 1700. Below the white arc, first notch flaps. Nice. Maintain heading, altitude, stable. Stable, second notch. Heading, altitude, stable. Third notch. 65. Simulate the descent. Oh, okay, put that right. nose down. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Get it to get it to a 65. We're a little bit low on that airspeed, so we'll get okay. 65. Maintain that approach speed. And we're gonna, as we do that, we're gonna get our uh, altitude back. So we're we're gonna lose altitude on this. I, I, I want to see you get it to 65. Okay, so more exactly. So just pitch down. I don't care that we're losing altitude. Oh yeah, because we are gonna lose altitude. Exactly. Right. Okay. 65. Perfect. 65. So power idle. So keep your hand there. Power idle, and then slowly pull back. It's nice, easy pressure. 
Keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming, all the way, all the way. That's beautiful, that's beautiful. Keep Here's it going, all the way, all the way. See the, the wing want to drop? Left Left running. Oh, uh, that's it, now recover it. Full power. Full power, first launch of left immediately. Yes, indeed. Establish that climb. Wait until our rate of climb goes. Release the Kraken! There we go. Looks like we're stable. We uh, went off our heading a little bit. That's okay, you can get that back, that's cool. And then climbing back up to 3,000 feet, we want to climb away from the runway. Nice man, how did that feel for you? Feel okay? It was good, yeah, yeah. 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 Nice and easy. I knew even, I mean, I kind of was starting to feel it even as I was pulling back when the power was idle. Yeah. Uh, I think we were going to one side or so. I was already getting myself into, okay, if something happens, then I'm already exactly. going to have to start exactly. using a little bit of a uh, left rudder. And when it, when it did want to drop away, it wanted to go to the right, I think we had maybe a little bit too much right rudder in. So you, you never did anything with this, you just corrected it with a uh, rudder and you saw it corrected yeah, itself. It, yeah. it brought that wing back down and it was back uh, stable. Perfect. Well, give me a turn, let's go north. Alright, so we'll try to maintain 2800, stay on northbound and uh, go for it. Yep, go for it. Alright, 1700. Southbound on Pitcher for speed. Yes, yes, indeed. Yes, 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 yes. Northbound, 28, perfect. Below the white arc, first notch. Stable, beautiful. Second notch. And third notch. You gotta simulate that descent. Yep, gonna get out right. to uh, perfect. 65, right around there. That'll work. Idle. Idle. Let's go idle and pitch up just a little bit. Nice and easy, nice and smooth. Keep it coming, keep it coming more than that, there you go. Okay. Keep it coming and slowly just keep that uh, that control column coming back, slowly. A little bit less left rudder. Less, less. Better stall, but... There it goes, he wants to go away from you. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful, man. Full. First notch of flaps right away. Oh, we're, we've got to make sure that we're yeah, exactly. going away from the runway. Yeah, exactly, yep. Stabilize. Oh, heading was off a little. A little bit. You can keep your eyes on references outside to see if the nose is going right or left during the stall. Okay. But um, Iron Man is trying to relax after the uh, Nice! Stalls. This is my time to... <laughs> <laughs> Finally! <laughs> that was it. That's it. That's it. That's I was something. expecting like a... I don't know, something to like the plane to really drop or no, something. Or no, no, no. You just hear the stall warning. You stall warning, that. you feel the buffet. Once the nose wants to go away from you, you kind of just... You let it because you recover from a stall by... Uh, lowering the angle of attack, okay. getting the airflow back to, back to, to the, the wings, wings. Yep. exactly. And yeah, increase the power, get rid of the flaps, climb away. The power on the stalls are a little bit more uh, temperamental because okay. you've got power in there, which accentuates the left turning tendencies. You having put too much rudder in has actually shown me that you know how to recover if it does want to go into a spin. Right. Right. Because you, you kicked the rudder, you didn't even move this. You know, yeah. you resisted the temptation to move this, which is huge. Uh, that, is that, does that make it worse? Oh yeah. If you try yeah, yeah. to do it, then okay. Yeah. Let's say you go. Let's say that the plane is spinning to this side, right? Right. To the right side, and you try and lift the the right wing, okay? Because you want it to stop it spinning. You would turn to the left. When you, what's the byproduct of, of lift? Uh, drag. Drag, right? So if you try and lift that wing, you got extra drag on that side. If you try and lift that wing, the aileron goes down on uh, on that side to try and lift it. What happens to angle of attack of the wing? Gets greater. Get greater. Yep. So you more angle of attack, more drag. It's just dragging you into the spin. Oh, that's what it's doing. Yeah. Okay, we'll keep spinning then. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Keep doing it, idiot. Yeah. I like this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I could do this all day. Sweet man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good session.